Brought to you by wikivd.com Maltese language Maltese is the national language of Malta, and a co-official language of the country alongside English, while also serving as an official language of the European Union. The only Semitic language so distinguished, Maltese is descended from Siculo Arabic, the extinct variety of Arabic that developed in Sicily and was later introduced to Malta. Between the end of the 9th century and the end of the 12th century AD, Maltese has evolved independently of literary Arabic and its varieties into a standardized language. Over the past 800 years in a gradual process of Latinization, Maltese is therefore considered an exceptional branch of Arabic that is not mutually intelligible. With Standard Arabic and Classical Arabic, Maltese is also unique among Semitic languages, since its morphology has been deeply influenced by Romance languages namely Italian and Sicilian. The original Semitic base comprises around one-third of the Maltese vocabulary especially words that denote basic ideas and the function words. But about half of the vocabulary is derived from standard Italian and Sicilian, and English words make up between 6% and 20% of the vocabulary. A recent study shows that, in terms of basic everyday language speakers of Maltese are able to understand less than a third of what is said to them in Tunisian Arabic which is related to Siculo Arabic, whereas speakers of Tunisian are able to understand about 40% of what is said to them in Maltese. This reported level of asymmetric intelligibility is considerably lower than the mutual intelligibility found between Arabic dialects. Maltese has always been written in the Latin script the earliest surviving example dating from the late Middle Ages. It remains the only standardized Semitic language written in the Latin script. History The origins of the Maltese language are attributed to the arrival early in the 11th century of settlers from neighboring Sicily where Siculo Arabic was spoken. Following the Fatimid Caliphate's conquest of the island at the end of the 9th century, this claim has been corroborated by genetic studies, which show that contemporary Maltese people share common ancestry with Sicilians and Calabrians, with little genetic input from North Africa and the Levant. The Norman conquest in 1090 followed by the expulsion of the Muslims permanently isolated the vernacular from its Arabic source, creating the conditions for its evolution into a distinct language. In contrast to Sicily, the vernacular in Malta continued to develop alongside Italian, eventually replacing it as official language in 1934. The first written reference to the Maltese language is in a will of 1436 where it is called Lingua Maltense. The oldest known document in Maltese is Il Cantalina by Pietro Caxero. It dates from the 15th century. The earliest known Maltese dictionary was a 16th century manuscript entitled Maltese Italiano. It was included in the Bibliotheca Maltese of Mifsud in 1764 but is now lost. A list of Maltese words was included in both the Thesaurus Polyglottis and Propuniaculum Europare of Hieronymus Magiza who had visited Malta in 1588-89. Domenico Magri gave the etymologies of some Maltese words in his Hierolexicon. Sive Sacrum Dictionarium, an early manuscript dictionary Dizionario Italiano e Maltese, was discovered in the Bibliotheca Vallicelliana in Rome in the 1980s together with a grammar. The regal Pala lingua Maltese attributed to a French knight named Thezanne. The first systematic lexicon is that of Giovanni Pietro Francesco Argius de Soldanis who also wrote the first systematic grammar of the language and proposed a standard orthography. Demographics 
In 1975 there were an estimated 371,000 Maltese speakers of whom 300,000 resided in Malta. Thousands of Maltese emigrants in Australia, Canada, Italy, the United Kingdom, and the United States still speak the language, and in 2007 it was reported that Maltese is still spoken by descendants of Maltese immigrants in Tunisia. Classification Maltese is descended from Siculo Arabic, a Semitic language within the Afroasiatic family that in the course of its history has been influenced by Sicilian and Italian, to a lesser extent French and more recently English. Today the core vocabulary is Semitic, with large numbers of loanwords. Because of the Sicilian influence on Siculo Arabic, Maltese has many language contact features and is most commonly described as a language with a large number of loanwords. The Maltese language has historically been classified in various ways, with some claiming that the ancient Punic language was its origin instead of Siculo Arabic, while others believe the language to be one of the Berber languages. And under the Fascist Kingdom of Italy it was classified as regional Italian. Consonants Voiceless stops are only lightly aspirated and voice stops are fully voiced. Voicing is carried over from the last segment in obstruent clusters, thus two and three obstruent clusters are either voiceless or voiced throughout and more is realized. We write, Maltese has final obstruent voicing of voiced obstruents, and voiceless stops have no audible release, making voiceless voice pairs phonetically indistinguishable. Germination is distinctive word medially and word finally in Maltese. The distinction is most rigid intervocalically after a stressed vowel. Stressed word final closed syllables with short vowels end in a long consonant and those with a long vowel in a single consonant. The only exception is where historic and meant the compensatory lengthening of the succeeding vowel. Some speakers have lost length distinction in clusters, the two nasals and assimilate, for place of articulation in clusters, and are usually dental whereas are all alveolar, are found mostly in words of Italian origin retaining length, and are only found in loanwords, and more newspaper and television. The pharyngeal fricative is velar glottal, for some speakers. Stress Stress is generally on the penultimate syllable unless some other syllable is heavy, or unless a stress-shifting suffix is added. When two syllables are equally heavy, the penultimate takes the stress but otherwise the heavier syllable does. And more Barjad, he painted, versus Barjad, a painter. Alphabet The modern system of Maltese orthography was introduced in 1924. Below is the Maltese alphabet, with IPA symbols and approximate English pronunciation, final vowels, with grave accents are also found in some Maltese words of Italian origin such as libita, sigurtura socjeta. The official rules governing the structure of the Maltese language are found in the official guidebook issued by the Accademia Tal Malti, the Academy of the Maltese Language which is named Tariff Fuqil Kibber Maltia that is knowledge on writing in Maltese. The first edition of this book was printed in 1924 by the Maltese government's printing press. The rules were further expanded in the 1984 book is IEDA Mat Tariff, which focused mainly on the increasing influence of Romance and English words. In 1992, the Academy issued the Agornament at Tariff Fuqil Kibber Maltia, which updated the previous works. All these works were included in a revised and expanded guidebook published in 1996. The National Council for the Maltese Language is the main regulator of the Maltese language, and not the Academia Tal Malti. However, these orthography rules are still valid and official. Written Maltese 
Since Maltese evolved after the Italo-Normans ended the Arab rule of the islands, a written form of the language was not developed. For a long time after the Arabs' expulsion in the middle of the 13th century, under the rule of the Knights Hospitaller both French and Italian were used for official documents and correspondence. During the British colonial period, the use of English was encouraged through education, with Italian regarded as the next most important language. In 1934, Maltese was recognized as an official language. In the late 18th century, and throughout the 19th century philologists, and academics such as Michiel Anton Vasily made a concerted effort to standardize written Maltese. Many examples of written Maltese exist from before this period, always in the Latin alphabet Il Cantalina being the earliest example of written Maltese. Vocabulary Although the original vocabulary of the language was secular Arabic, it has incorporated a large number of borrowings from Romance sources of influence, and more recently Germanic ones. The historical source of modern Maltese vocabulary is 52% Italian, Sicilian 32% Siculo Arabic, and 6% English with some of the remainder being French. Today most function words are Semitic. In this way it is similar to English which is a Germanic language that had large influence from Norman French. As a result of this Romance language speakers may easily be able to comprehend more complex ideas expressed in Maltese such as orographicament, Eli Ropa High Party Taz Supercontinent Ta, Eli Russia, while not understanding a single word of a simple sentence such as I R Rajal Kieft Fid Da, which would be easily understood by any Arabic speaker. Romance an analysis of the etymology of the 41,000 words in Aquilina's Maltese English Dictionary shows that words of Romance origin make up 52% of the Maltese vocabulary although the sources claim from as low as 40% to as high as 55%. These vocabularies tend to deal with more complicated concepts. They are mostly derived from Sicilian and thus exhibit Sicilian phonetic characteristics such as in place of and in place of. Also, as with Old Sicilian is written, X, and this produces spellings such as, Ambacatazina. A tendency in modern Maltese is to adopt further influences from English and Italian. Complex Latinate English words adopted into Maltese are often given Italianate or Sicilianate forms even if the resulting words do not appear in either of those languages. For instance the words evaluation industrial action and chemical armaments become eval was Johnny as Johnny industrially and armament e chemisi in Maltese, while the Italian terms evalutazione vertenza syndical and arm chimit respectively. English words of Germanic origin are generally preserved relatively unchanged. Siculo-Arabic Siculo-Arabic is the ancestor of the Maltese language and supplies between 32% and 40% of the language's vocabulary. Found that 40% of a sample of 1,820 Quranic Arabic roots were found in Maltese a lower percentage than found in Moroccan and Lebanese Arabic. An analysis of the etymology of the 41,000 words in Aquilina's Maltese English Dictionary shows that 32% of the Maltese vocabulary is of Arabic origin although another source claims 40%. Usually, words expressing basic concepts and ideas such as are of Arabic origin. Moreover, in Maltese tend to aim mainly at diction belonging to this group. The Maltese language has merged many of the original Arabic consonants, in particular the emphatic consonants with others that are common in European languages. Thus, original Arabic and all merged into Maltese. The vowels however separated, from the three in Arabic to five as is more typical of other European languages. 
Some unstressed short vowels have been elided. The common Arabic greeting is cognate. Within Maltesers are similar greetings in other Semitic languages. Since the attested vocabulary of Siculo Arabic is limited, the following table compares cognates in Maltese and some other varieties of Arabic. English It is estimated that English loanwords, which are becoming more commonplace, make up 20% of the Maltese vocabulary although the sources claim amounts as low as 6%. This percentage discrepancy is due to the fact that a number of new English loanwords are sometimes not officially considered part of the Maltese vocabulary, hence they are not included in certain dictionaries. Also, English loanwords of Latin at origin are very often Italianized as discussed above. English loanwords are generally transliterated. Although standard English pronunciation is virtually always retained, Below are a few examples, note fridge which is a slang term derived from refrigerator, a Latinate word which might be expected to be rendered as refrigeratory. Grammar Maltese grammar is fundamentally derived from secular Arabic although romance and English noun pluralization patterns are also used on borrowed words. Adjectives and adverbs adjectives follow nouns. There are no separately formed native adverbs, and word order is fairly flexible. Both nouns, and adjectives of Semitic origin, take the definite article. This rule does not apply to adjectives of Romance origin. Nouns Nouns are pluralized and also have a dual marker. Semitic plurals are complex. If they are regular, they are marked by IET, IJ, IET, and more Artartari at lands or in. If irregular, they fall in the pluralist fractus category in which a word is pluralized by internal vowel changes. Katib Kobber book books, Rachel Ergiel Man Men. Words of Romance origin are usually pluralized in two manners addition of IJ, IET. For example, lingua lingui languages from Sicilian lingua lingui. Words of English origin are pluralized by adding either an S or J I E T, for example, frig, frigus from the word fridge. Some words can be pluralized with either of the suffixes to denote the plural. A few words borrowed from English can amalgamate both suffixes, like brixa from the English brick which can adopt either collective form bricks or the plural form bricks it. Article The proclitic il is the definite article equivalent to the in English and al in Arabic. The Maltese article becomes l before or after a vowel. The Maltese article assimilates to a following coronal consonant, namely, Maltese il is coincidentally identical in pronunciation to the one of the Italian masculine articles il, which is also l, before, but not after a vowel. Consequently many nouns borrowed from standard Italian did not change their original article. When used in Maltese, Romance vocabulary taken from Sicilian did change, where the Sicilian articles u and a before a consonant are used. In spite of its Romance appearance il is related to the Arabic article al, Verbs Verbs show a trilateral Semitic pattern in which a verb is conjugated with prefixes, suffixes, and infixes we wrote. There are two tenses, present and perfect. The Maltese verb system incorporates Romance verbs and adds Maltese suffixes and prefixes. To them de see to decide a Romance verb ejna a Maltese first-person plural perfect marker. Dialects Urban varieties of Maltese are closer to standard Maltese than rural varieties, which have some characteristics that distinguish them from standard Maltese. They tend to show some archaic features such as the realization of kh and gh, and the amala of Arabic a into e considered archaic. 
because they are reminiscent of 15th century transcriptions of this sound. Another archaic feature is the realization of standard Maltese ASO in rural dialects. There is also a tendency to diphthong I's simple vowels and more U becomes O U. -U. Rural dialects also tend to employ more Semitic roots and broken plurals than standard Maltese. In general rural Maltese is less distant from its secular Arabic ancestor than standard Maltese. Media With Malta being a multilingual country the usage of Maltese in the mass media is shared with other European languages namely English and Italian. The majority of television stations broadcast from Malta in English and Maltese although broadcasts from Italy and Italian are also received on the islands. Similarly, there are more Maltese-language radio programs than English ones broadcast from Malta but again us. With television Italian broadcasts are also picked up. Maltese generally receives equal usage in newspaper periodicals to English. By early 2000s, the use of the Maltese language on the Internet is uncommon and the number of websites written in Maltese are few. In a survey of Maltese cultural websites conducted in 2004 on behalf of the Maltese government, 12 of 13 were in English only while the remaining one was multilingual but did not include Maltese. Code switching The Maltese population being fluent in both Maltese and English displays code switching in certain localities and between certain social groups. Brought to you by Wikivd.com Would you like to know more?